So we have Trevor and Kathy, Kathy Drury Klein, event director of Dressage by the Sea, and not the first time. How many Dressage by the Seas have you done now, Kathy? Uh, seven. Seven. <laughs> this is the seventh. And <laughs> uh, yeah, and so far it's um, an amazing venue. When we first came and used Wollonga Park, the top stables or the competition stables were dirt roads, uh, portaloos, portable showers, no swimming pool. And the whole venue has turned into an amazing equestrian park since those early days. Absolutely. And, and Trevor, who's uh, the man behind the scenes and does everything from tractor driving to draws to you name it. And uh, the sport would be lost without these two characters. Don't you worry about that. So um, how many horses were here at this competition? Well, we actually had 280 horses enter the event. Unfortunately, owing to the, um, the only having three competition arenas, we had to have very long reserve lists, which is an excellent sign for the sport. Um, but I'm ha happy competitors that didn't get in and get to experience the venue. Yeah, it's a shame. It's been such a beautiful and next venue. time. We'll be running an event again in July for yes. the people to come and enjoy this remarkable venue. So that will be, that's really something to look forward to. Those yeah. that may not have gotten in this time. Yeah, and you know, it doesn't matter how many people say how wonderful the venue is and etc. etc. <laughs> and no matter how many photos or videos you see, you cannot appreciate the place until you come here. So uh, No, until you drive through that front gate, Yep. it's impossible to visualise. Well, congratulations to you guys on yet another successful uh, competition. And hallelujah, at last you've come to the very pointy end. Look, one more presentation to go and all done. So congratulations not only from EQ Life, but also from everybody involved in the sport because you really bind it all together. Thanks, Kathy and Trevor. Thanks, Thanks Roger. Roger.